so in this session we'll be just seeing the practical implementation of okay overloading tree increment operator that is a unary plus plus operator using friend function so till now we have seen this programming without friend function so now we'll be just implementing it with the help of a friend function okay so i'll be just creating okay a data member of type int inside the class so this is the data member that i have declared in the private section so in the public section i'll be just creating a constructor that is an parameterized constructor okay and this is used to just initialize this okay value that is a okay so this a has been initialized with this particular constructor okay so now what i'll be doing i'll be just creating a method that is used to display the incremented value of a after the operator overloading operation has been performed so what i'll write i'll just write c out the value of a is equal to a and i'll just give a new line okay so this operation has been completed so now the function definition part has been left so we will just cover it okay later so first of all i'll just create a main and inside main i have to create certain objects of type opre so i'll be just creating o1 and i'll just pass certain parameter inside this because it is of type okay constructor a parameterized constructor and o2 okay so the next statement is i have to just write the statement like o2 is equal to plus plus o1 because this is a free increment operation and this call will be resolved by the compiler as o2 is equal to operator keyword okay plus plus and as an argument what i have to pass i have to pass o1 as an argument because now i am working with friend function okay so this is a friend function call okay so now for the compiler this operator plus plus is being treated as a function and o1 has been passed as an argument inside this function and the value has been returned to o2 and o2 is of type opre that is of type class okay so this is capital here so now what i'll be doing i'll be just okay printing the value of o2 and o1 okay so i'll be just writing okay o2 dot show okay and o1 dot show okay so after the friend function has completed the operation so the value of a will be incremented okay so in this a value will be incremented okay and also in this a value will be incremented okay so this o1 is the object that i have passed as an argument and o2 is that the assignment that has been made okay so now we'll write the function definition so i am just okay defining the function the friend function inside the class because there is a single data member that i have to work upon because there is only a single class okay so if there is a single class then there is no need to declare the friend function inside the class and to and to define it outside the class okay for a single class you can just directly define the friend function inside the class only but if there are multiple classes okay then you have to declare the friend function in each of the class and you have to define this friend function outside the class okay for all these classes so i'll be just writing the keyword friend okay followed by the name of the class because it will return certain object and object is of type class so this is the return type followed by operator keyword okay so this is operator and we are we are just okay overloading plus plus operator okay so inside this what i have to pass i have to pass the reference okay so the reference is of type opre and i'll be just taking okay any you can say object of type okay this opre so i have just passed ampersand c so now the main task is i have to just create a temporary variable so i'll just create a temporary variable temp of type opre and i'll be just writing temp dot a is equal to plus plus okay k dot a so now i have just invoked okay the mechanism plus plus k dot a because now the call is explicit because this o2 has been passed as an argument so in order to access this o2 i have to just use the dot operator okay because this is an explicit operation this is not an implicit operation okay this has been explicitly passed by the user so the user has to call it explicitly with the help of the dot operator because it is an indirect call it is we are just accessing the data member with the help of the reference okay so this is how we use friend function to access the data members indirectly with the help of the object reference so the name is not k this is c okay the reference is of type c so it will be plus plus c dot so i'll be just returning this temp okay so the temp has been returned and i think the program has been completed so let's try to execute this program okay let's try to check for any errors 
so the error is due to we haven't created any user defined constructor okay user defined default constructor is absent from our class because here we have created an object o2 okay so for this object o2 there should be some constructor that should be present in our class so it is absent and also for this temp okay the constructor is absent because this is also an object of type opr okay so that's why for a single you can say error okay it has you can say raised so many errors so i'll just create a default constructor of type opr and i hope now the error will be resolved okay so let's try to compile it so you can see that the error has been resolved so this is a small logic okay so now we'll try to execute this so here you can see that the value of a is 11 and the value of a is 11 okay so first is the value of a that is this a is of o2 okay and the second is this a of o1 okay so both the values has been incremented okay so increment operation has been performed by the compiler i hope this is clear